less than a minute. Little time remains to wager on the fifth. This is your final call for your Belmoral Park fifth race. Exactas, trifectas, superfectas, and other wagers. Freshman fillies are moving to the gate. The starter calls. They're at the gate for the co-featured fifth race at Belmoral Park, the $255,000 orange and blue final for two-year-old Philly Pacers. The gate is rolling. Eighth of a mile to the start. Here they come. And they're off, and the only lever is Dreams Made Real, and she and Tony Morgan get an easy lead as they race into the first turn. Dreams Made Real has the lead. Finance the Farm is second by two and a half. Fox Valley Muffin is third. Loyal Opposition unhurried in fourth by two and a half. Fox Valley Ivy is fifth. Then it's Splanky in sixth, followed in seventh by Fox Valley Lady Dock. Change the game is eighth. Macy Wave is ninth, and Can Commute is the trailer. It's Dreams Made Real on an uncontested lead going by the first quarter in 28-2. and two. Dreams Made Real has the lead by a length and a half. In the pocket second is Finance the Farm by two and a half. Fox Valley Muffin is third, two and a quarter. Miller unhurried in fourth with Loyal Opposition. Fox Valley Ivy tips to the outside in fifth and will flush out Loyal Opposition from fourth. Third over in sixth is Splanky and they're going to be left second and First over because loyal opposition is gunning up for the lead. And now Morgan asks for a little more pace from Dreams Made Real. And these two hook up past the half. That goes in 57 and 1, 28 and 4 for the second quarter. And on the inside, Dreams Made Real has the lead. Miller will drop into the pocket if he can. He can. Eitman tried to close up the pocket but couldn't with Finance the Farm. Up on the outside in fourth is Fox Valley Ivy. On the inside, Fox Valley Muffin is fifth. It's a gap to six. We're on the far outside. It's Fox Valley Lady Doc, but it's Dreams Made Real who got away with an easy first half. Three quarters, one, 24 and three, 27 and two for the third quarter. Three sixteenths of a mile to go. It's Dreams Made Real, the leader by a length and a half. Being put to the question now is loyal opposition and she's not answering that question. It's Dreams Made Real who's moving up by four. Loyal opposition's win streak is over. Dreams Made Real destroys this field. Loyal opposition, a hard trying second, close for third and fourth between Finance the Farm or Fox Valley Muffin. One. 52 and 3, just a fifth of a second off the track record. In the fifth race, three dreams made real was first, four loyal opposition was second. It's a photograph for show and fourth to complete the trifecta and superfecta. Fractions of 28 and 2, 57 and 1, 124 and 3. 152 and 3.
returning to the winner's circle with her second in a row as she pushes his career earnings over $100,000 is Dreams Made Real. She's a two-year-old daughter of Cole Muffler out of the Broadway Express Mare Broadway Creation. Is owned by Mike Dockendorf and Nick Triantafel of Illinois, trained by Mark Franson, who records his ninth Super Night Championship, second to Joe Anderson, driven by Tony Morgan. Dreams Made Real, pacing to a winning mile of 152 and three. Great drive by Tony, stole the fractions in the first half. The Philly up to the task in the final half. It's a driving double consecutively for Tony Morgan. Making the orange and blue presentation will be Commissioner Walter Dudich, the executive director of the Illinois Racing Board, as Tony Morgan records his sixth Super Night Championship drive. Executive Director of the Illinois Racing Board, Commissioner Walter Dudich, making the plaque presentation to the Connections. In the photograph, for show, one, Finance the Farm was third, two, Fox Valley Muffin was fourth. It's official. Use tariffs.